Hi everyone, in this video we're going to go over how to use the classic editor after updating to WordPress 5.0. Now the very first way that you're going to be able to use the classic editor is by using a classic editor block. Which means you can use the classic WYSIWYG editor right alongside the new Gutenberg blocks. Alright, so well, let's take a look at this post. Alright, as you can see right here I have a classic block. And right underneath it I have some new Gutenberg blocks. But if I go back over to the classic block, you can see that I can add text. There's an image in the block, just like um, just like you would see in the old editor. And you can also um, uh, highlight the text and edit it just like you did before. Now the next way, and probably more than likely how the majority of you are going to end up using the classic editor, is by installing the classic editor plugin. Now to do that, let's go to our plugins page. All right, and now let's go ahead and click the add new button. And the classic editor is right here on the front page of the feature plugins. Click the install now. And let's go ahead and click activate. And let's go back over to our post and let's go to how to use the classic editor. Let's go back to editing that. And now as we can see, there is no more Gutenberg blocks and you can now edit it just like you would have prior to updating to WordPress 5.0. Now keep in mind, this is just going to be a, a temporary change. Uh, the WordPress Gutenberg team has committed to supporting the uh, classic editor plugin until 2021 but eventually all of us are going to need to move over to the new Gutenberg block system. Now don't forget to hit that subscribe button. We are going to be releasing new videos on a very consistent basis that are going to cover all things WordPress. You're not going to want to miss out on that. Hey, thanks guys. Have a great day.